I think I may have found the best Apple pencil case and it's made of paper. Hello and welcome to another Nihongo Gamer video. I am always looking for the perfect type of bag or case for my tech gear and I was walking around Tokyo looking for a pencil case that would only hold one Apple pencil because really I don't really carry a pen or a pencil with me anywhere. I don't really need more than one device. Essentially I have my iPad and I have my Apple pencil and really the only thing, other thing that I carry is maybe the glove that comes with it. Before I was using this uh, very, very nice Derwent case. This is a sort of fabric case that you can use for art supplies because it opens like this. Uh, when I do use a pencil, I use a Blackwing 602 and it's a very long pencil when you first use it. So if I didn't have this case, uh, it wouldn't really fit in any of my other pencil cases. But I was going through Tokyo and I could not find it. I went through so many shops looking for a pencil case before I found this one. This is a pencil case which only holds one implement. I will unzip it for you. And what's very special about this is that it uh, is made of paper. So you can see the inside of the case here. Uh, it may not, you may think that because it's made of paper it's not very strong, but what's really special about this is it's been treated so that it's water resistant and it won't break. I mean, well, it won't break easily, rather. So I can uh, really give it a, a bit of a beating and it won't um, break. It will uh, It will eventually fold and, you know, the longer you use it, it will become, it'll have these creases and that sort of thing. But uh, what's really great for me is that it holds this one Apple Pencil. So I've actually rolled it up in the glove, but if you don't happen to use a glove and you don't, you don't need that, uh, then you can actually just fit this in here and it's Perfect, it's just a perfect size for the Apple Pencil if you don't need anything more than this. This is the company that's making it, it's called Shiwa, which is basically washi backwards, <laughs> which means uh, Japanese paper. I don't really know what's especially Japanese about Japanese paper, maybe it's because it's patterned or because it's strong and it's useful for origami. Anyway, they, when you buy this uh, product, you also get this tester card. Now I did try to rip it and I was able to rip it if I used my nails, but essentially is much, much stronger than your average piece of paper. Plus it's got a few, uh, it's got some information here about the fact that it's uh, water resistant, uh, you know, it's light. What else are they trying to say on here? <laughs> it's so funny that uh, their their gimmick is that it's paper that really doesn't break easily, that you even, you know, even get this uh, tester paper so that you can just really try and rip it and it doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't rip very easily at all unless you use your nails. So I did like really dig in with my nails and I was able to rip it here. The reason I'm very excited is that it holds just the Apple Pencil and that's actually very very difficult to find. There was not a Kickstarter, there was some other you know crowdsourcing, crowdfunding program for some a case called like the Johnny case. It was called the Johnny. I thought it looked hilarious because it looks a lot like the Apple Pencil but it only holds the Apple Pencil. I think I thought it was the perfect case and it looks like they were vastly underfunded. Maybe the number of people who need a case for their Apple Pencil or people looking to spend $30 on a case was not that many. This case uh, was about $8. It's about a thousand yen. So it's very, very uh, inexpensive, plus it's very, very strong. I, I'm really, really happy about this. Now the real benefit for me as well is that uh, when I tested it with the glove as well, uh, you don't have to wrap the pencil in the glove like I do. Uh, in fact, you can actually just stuff it in the case like this. And if I try and zip it, yeah, see it does shut no problem. This is really, really, really nice because I don't carry a pencil, I don't carry a pen, I don't carry scissors. Uh, some, I, know some, I know people carry around scissors everywhere they go, that's kind of freaky. I just have my Apple Pencil, my iPad, and now I can, have, I can have it all in a package which is even smaller than before. This was a really nice case, and especially if you've got like a black wing or a pencil which is just too long, this is a really cool case to have. But I have found what I consider to be the best Apple Pencil case. It's by a company called uh, Shiwa. So just look it up, S-I-W-A dot J-P. I'll put the link in the description below. I don't get paid by them or anything, but I would love for them to succeed because I think they should start marketing it as an Apple Pencil case because that's what it's perfect for. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to uh, comment, subscribe, share the links and all that good stuff. And uh, if you like, uh, if you enjoyed it or you've got any comments, any improvements uh, on the format, 
do let me know in the comments section below. I'll see you next time. Hello and welcome to Ultimate Comparison iPad Pro. Today we're going to be looking at the iPad Pro 9.7 inch device and comparing it with the 12.9 inch device with a particular focus on drawing. So essentially, if you want to draw a full body character on the iPad Pro 9.7 in landscape, it is possible. I just did find that I was zooming in a little bit more often. People weren't always staring over my shoulder like, oh, that guy's using an Apple Pencil on an iPad. I think really uh, people just kind of left me to do my own thing. It's just the way with art, isn't it? When you're practicing and you're not 100% sure that it's something that you're going to publish. You don't really want people to stare at it until you've actually published it. We can't just have a device that draws, we gotta have a device that draws and also does our homework and also watches YouTube videos and also sends emails and all of those hundreds of other things.